Pinball Mark Edition. Oh, man. That was the first game we played on for the Christian Gaming Sunday series. We did with Mark with his bowling, but now we got Pinball. Well, I think we should start with Pinball, then look at the story and look back at who Mark is. Ooh, it's a blue ball this time. Oh, whoops. I think I have to use the flippers. Uh, not the flippers, the... Uh... Okay, yeah. I wonder if we could do- no, I thought we could do this in one go. Oh, come on! No! One more. There we go. Last one should get the platinum. Yay, platinum achieved. But it isn't just playing pinball, there's a story mode, which we're gonna do now. Four levels of story mode. Let's hopefully the audio isn't just uh, spikes. Hi, I'm Mark. I'm in the eighth grade, and one day I hope to be a professional bowling player. I'm also dating a girl. Her name is Shane, and she's my very first girlfriend ever. My parents are fine with me dating at my age, but my dad has only told me one rule I need to follow. No kissing. He said I'm too young for that, and says that I'm not ready for the responsibility when... <laughs> that what comes with it. Mm -hmm. As we all know, Chris kissing makes girls pregnant. We can't have that. Well, since I've been dating Jane for a while now, I know that I'm ready to kiss her. Whoa, Mark, careful, you might want to slow down. And Dad would never find out if I did, would he? <laughs> hey, Mark, I think that might be a sinful act. I think that's called lust. One of the, one of the seven deadly sins. That... But if Dad was right about girls getting more committed to you when you kissed them, then maybe <laughs> it's another day. Uh, Mark and his girlfriend Jane are having a date, and they're ju just finishing eating their lunch at a restaurant. But Gatubin, but then I want to get dessert before we go. That the ice cream looks so good. <laughs> yeah, it does. So I'm gonna get that flavor. So I'm going to get the flavor right there. What do you want? Um... I can't... Oh, I can't decide. Oh, come on, just pick one. Uh, but I can't make up my mind. I want either that flavor or that flavor. But which one? Which one? Hey, I've got an idea. I downloaded this pinball game on my phone. So I have a challenge for you. Huh? If you get over 500 points before I lose, you get that flavor. But if you get under 500 points, you get that flavor over there. <laughs> what do you think about that? Um, alright, that sounds like a fun plan. <laughs> yeah, plus, I can get in some more rounds. Plus, I can get some more rounds played in the game. Giggle, I figured there was another reason you wanted to play. Yep. Okay, time to see how many points I can get. Oh, okay. I'm canonically playing the pinball game. Gotcha. Oh, is this gonna have like multiple endings if I get a high score? Nope. 
That was a legit play, I wasn't fumbling this. <clears throat> And so, Mark and Jane get ice cream to end their date. And now Mark is walking Jane to her house. <laughs> They're almost there too. And that's what's going on right now. There should be an answer on Thursday. Yeah. Oh, Lana, ice cream was great. Thanks for helping me decide which flavor to get. <laughs> sure thing. I gotta get better at making this. I gotta get better at making decisions for myself. Okay, here's your house, Shane. That's right. Thanks for a nice date, Mark. Uh, you're welcome. Have a nice night, and See you at school. Okay, you have a good night, too. Bye. Bye. Another day with Jane is done. Really like having a girlfriend. But... I'm really starting to feel respons... I'm, I'm starting to really feel that responsibility stuff uh, Dad was talking about. Um... <laughs> Meanwhile, God is like, hey, uh, that's called hormones. Uh, keep it in your pants. Act up on it when, you know, you're married and stuff, because, you know, that would be sinful. Gotta, gotta get married in a church, man. Or, uh, you know, if you want to be legal, do it in an office, it's cool. Weddings are expensive. Well, the piece of paper is expensive to prove that you're married. It's a whole, like, thing, man. It's, you know, just, just, you just go with it. Mark, we got you. You're bowling and pinball pro. You're cool. I have to practice bowling, hang out with my friends, relax at home, get my homework done, and go out with Jane. I have a lot of stuff to keep up with. And it's not, and it's not taking her out and just sitting there. Jane wants to talk and talk and talk and talk and talk. And then, like today, she needs help with things. And so I try to find a way to help her. It's, it is fun to learn about... It is fun to learn more about Jane. But talking to her, but... Kissing her would make dating even more fun. But if Dad was right about girls getting more committed to you once you kissed them, then... Can I really handle that kind of responsibility to her at this point in my life? Well... I'll take time to figure it out, out later. For now, I am getting everything done at school. My bowling's important, and now I have a girlfriend too. So I'll just make take things. Well, I'll just take things one day at a time and see what happens next. Okay, time to go home. And so Mark heads home with lots of thoughts and dreams in his mind. Mark's journey to eight great continues. Keep up the great work, Mark. As I, as your humble narrator, you go get a mark. And to everyone playing the game today, keep going for your dreams too. You can, you can get there if you don't give up. Hi, I'm Mark. It's time for another Project Summarize character blog. As a guy, I'm ha having a girlfriend can be a lot of fun. I dated Jane when I was in eighth grade. My dad allowed me to date, but he had one rule: hold off on kissing until I was a little bit more mature. He is right. Was he right or wrong in saying that? The truth that kissing is a small piece of a healthy romantic relationship. Talking and caring and learning about each other is more important. And those things are what we can keep our relationship strong. If And if this relationship is strong, the kissing will be even better. <laughs> Have self-control and you may learn how and much of fun it can be to grow in a relationship with a girl in another way than just kissing. And remember, patience is... Uh, patience is part of what love is described in, in the Bible in 1 Corinthians chapter 13. I don't have time to read that right now. I've that's, that's for yourself to read. Check it out and see what it says. Thank you for playing Project Summer Ice Pinball Mark version. You can find more adventures with me in the Project Summer Ice series. Just look for video games in the series in the store with my name, Mark. See you next... See you in my next video game adventure. Bye! And that was, yeah, Project Summarize Mark version. Huh. What will we do next week? Who knows? But there'll definitely be more Christian Gaming Sunday, as well as Normal Heroes 3. We're going to continue playing through that through the week, on days that I can, at least. That's just the way things are right now with my schedule. But anyway, folks, I've been your host. Just me, 
Simon. Just give him the name. And heck, Simon was a pretty cool dude in the Bible. He helped Jesus carry the cross. And you know what? Simon's a pretty powerful name. Yep. He's a total bro to Jesus. That's all that matters. Well then, folks, I'm gonna love you and leave you. And, uh... I guess it would be... Just like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell to stay notified for more Christian Gaming Sunday streams. And don't forget to thank... You know... God, Jesus, the Holy Spirit for giving us these great games. Well, folks, I gotta go. I got stuff to do. And yeah, well, yeah, I got I got places to be, people to hang out with, like with Mark. Uh, Mark, see you next time. See you then, folks.